Chief Meteorologist David Yeomans is joining us this afternoon. And even though our weather is quiet here, except for the heat, sure. you've been tracking some storms that are not on this planet necessarily. <laughs> these are called <laughs> solar storms. Wow. And if you haven't heard of these, scientists are actually expecting some significant ones later this week, leading to the northern lights across 17 states in the U.S. Now this year is actually an exceptionally active year on the sun as it reaches its 11 year peak in what's called its solar cycle. During this peak, more frequent and intense solar storms occur. The solar wind, as it's called, then carries charged particles from the sun, which collide with the Earth's outer atmosphere and produce that spectacular aurora borealis. Now, Texas is a bit too far south for this, unfortunately, but we do expect the northern lights to be visible this Thursday night as far south as Oregon, South Dakota, and Indiana. You can find the full list of all 17 U.S. states on KXAN.com.